In 2014, Bitcoin broke the RSI downtrend at about $350. It wasn't the exact bottom, but from that breakout point, we went up about 6,000% into a multi-year expansion phase. The same thing occurred in 2019. Bitcoin broke the RSI downtrend at about 3,500, leading us into a 1,800% expansion phase. And now Bitcoin in 2023 is attempting to do the same thing. So how are we gonna know if this RSI breakout is confirmed? Market interpretation is everything. And most of the time, a true breakout is associated with a market reaction. We're looking for some sort of reaction to confirm that the market agrees that the RSI has broken out. Looking at the Bitcoin weekly chart, we can see that the two year long RSI downtrend has been breached just ever so slightly. And we have not yet seen an actual reaction, a price pump above the downtrend line. What I'm looking for now is a breakout of the previous high on the RSI downtrend to give us the first higher high on the RSI in two years. And that would confirm Bitcoin's classic signal that the next expansion phase is starting. Now, it doesn't mean that we're gonna immediately go into some crazy bull market, but what it could indicate is that Bitcoin's long-term road to recovery may have begun. During the global pandemic, the Fed returned rates to near zero. This allowed Bitcoin and the S&P to have a massive spring, and most investors were doing extremely well, but since then, things have changed. The highest levels of inflation in decades are upon us. The Fed is raising rates aggressively, and these financial conditions are something that Bitcoin has never experienced before. A lot of top analysts, experts, and billionaires have already been talking about how the current market conditions are very similar to what's on the screen, which is the 1960s to the 80s. If you look at the performance of the S&P 500, then we overlay the federal funds rate, you can see that the rise in rates, the higher highs in interest rates, kept market conditions very flat. The market was really unable to get a major breakout until the interest rate started moving in a downward direction. And that is when the massive multi-decade bull market began. So the question is, what is Bitcoin's expansion phase going to look like if all of the factors that drove the stock market into a multi-decade bull market are being reversed? I think we could all agree that the world is changing at a pace that we've never seen before. And this is causing a lot of shakeups, volatility, uncertainty, but also opportunity. The phenomenon of tightening liquidity is now a global phenomenon which is going to make it much more difficult for markets to see sustained growth over time. Most people in my generation are used to markets being up only. They're used to zero rates, infinite money printing. All of those factors are changing in real time. And I think that those that are able to adapt will come out on top. I think that Bitcoin is gonna do just fine in this new environment, but there might be some changes to the way that the cycles play out. The cycles may become more compressed, the price action might become more choppy, and those that have honed in on their trading skills will be the ones that benefit the most. Now, to be clear, this is all just my opinion based on my research, and it just seems like the most likely outcome moving forward is going to be a lot of instability and uncertainty and a lot of volatility. And there's many reasons to believe that that's the case. The world is currently de-globalizing. Relationships between nations are actually degrading. We have war taking place and the United States is weaponizing the dollar. Russia is weaponizing commodities. So it's kind of hard for me to just expect things to be just like they were and we go up only, all comfortable and nice. I think it's gonna be a little bit different. Don't get me wrong, I am expecting Bitcoin to hit new all-time highs during the 2024 halving or after the 2024 halving. But the question is, if the stock market is playing out some sort of volatile multi-year range, how is that gonna change Bitcoin cycles? And things are changing. I mean, Bitcoin's gone below 20,000, which is below the previous all-time high, which it's never done before. But I am very confident that Bitcoin's next expansion phase is likely about to begin. That's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. 
smash the like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one.